हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल जस्ट कोड इट विद सार्थक टुडे आई एम बैक विद अ पार्ट टू ऑफ द वीडियो विद तन्मय आर्य इन दिस पॉडकास्ट वी हैव प्रीवियसली डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द जोमैटो एक्सपीरियंस आई विल पुटिंग द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स इन द कार्ड अबाउट हियर हियर समवेयर एंड वी विल बी गोइंग थ्रू वर्ड्स द एमएनसी एक इंटरव्यू एक्सपीरियंस एंड फॉर दैट वी विल बी टेकिंग एमेजॉन एग्जांपल ही इज करेंटली वर्किंग एट एज एज दी एट एमेजॉन he was able to crack that interview process and he will be sharing what kind of uh, what, what kind of interview ex- uh, uh, experience was his uh, with regards to amazon what are the number of rounds uh, how tough were the questions from where he practiced and what are the what are his dis- uh, d- feedback for differences between startup interview experience and mnc interview experience we will be discussing all these in depth and uh, for that i ask you to stay tuned to the video till the last okay Before starting with the video, let's thank the supporter of this channel, Newton School. So, guys, uh, what is Newton School? Newton School is a tech startup where uh, you can learn more about uh, different technologies out there. Uh, they will help you get job offers from these top tech companies, and they have a very good program where you don't have to pay one rupee until you get a job from these companies. They have very good uh, offerings with this uh, course. Uh, live classes industrial projects mock interviews and personal mentoring uh, i will put the link in the description and i suggest you all to check this out and explore their courses moving towards your current position if you are i, I am aware that you are in amazon and the audience would love to know how was the amazon interview experience uh, how did it started and what what are the discre- uh, like differences that you can find over a startup interview experience over the mnc interview experience so how how was the interview experience of amazon so at amazon you know the uh, majorly the interviews were focused on my problem solving and my behavioral uh, instinct of uh, how exactly i react to some conditions mm-hmm. so mostly uh, interview was based on they have you know divided in every interview basically uh, my interview uh, i have total five rounds initially okay. the coding test after that uh, the screening round and then i have the four uh, interviews Uh, personal mm-hmm. interviews uh, which uh, all uh, every every interview includes you know the dsa question first two mm-hmm. were majorly based on dsa uh, questions uh, like uh, you know having the medium to hard level of questions uh, okay. apart from that after th- those two rounds uh, the third round was also uh, based on you know uh, the dsa and then uh, it was around, about the discussion of my current projects and uh, what i have previously done and mm-hmm. the fourth round was the hiring manager round so okay. in that round uh, uh, partially it was on dsa and the partially it was based on system design mm-hmm. okay so that was the whole uh, uh, interview experience that i had okay at amazon so, so before starting with your screening or the coding round uh, how was the process like did you apply by the company website or did you apply by a referral and how long did it take to get to from applying to the fi- uh, the first uh, getting the test link yeah so uh, basically i searched for the positions open at amazon i got mm-hmm. one uh, position so i asked a friend working at amazon you know to refer me because you know uh, directly applying uh, reduces your chance and uh, if someone refers you it definitely increases your chance so i searched for a friend who is currently working at amazon i mm-hmm. asked her for a referral and she referred me after the referral within a week i got a test link Mm-hmm. and uh, i'll say that this process this complete process was a really long you know because there was a second wave in between of this only so my process started in march and you know it took around june it was around 3 months of process okay so aapke initial yeah. process mein hi kaafi time lag gaya because of certain pandemic situations and other circumstances exactly mm-hmm. basically mere interview schedule hone ke baad hi like second wave uh, ne hit kiya and you know my rounds were continuously uh, postponed Uh, like because the interviews were also not well and so uh, considering everyone situation my uh, interview almost took you know my process almost took around 3 and a half months okay so we can take this this could be an exceptional experience but ha aapke case mein ho sakta hai itna lamba time na le okay so starting with the first part so coding uh, if i have to explain like how many questions were there in the coding round how, how would you rate their uh, difficulty and what kind of questions were there in the coding round like in the sense of dsa based or they were development based or they were logical mcq based questions all right so basically they have very you know tight schedule of an interview every interview has a proper uh, part you know time bound part like uh, for a one hour interview five minutes are for your introduction mm-hmm. then uh, they have kept separate 15 minutes 
for uh, 10 to 15 minutes for the behavioral questions that they will uh, depending upon the interview that will they will uh, ask in the starting or in the end uh, apart from that, the remaining 40 minutes are for DSA, where mm-hmm. they'll mostly ask you two questions. Generally, there are two questions uh, mm-hmm. in a round, where you they'll, uh, you know, uh, explain you the question. Then you will give them approach and you have to code the question also in those 40 minutes on. Okay. So basically, the rounds are in the coding questions, the DSA, uh, uh, DSA based, and you have to think of the solution as well as code the solution in front of the interview. Okay. Yeah, and... exactly. First, think of a uh, solution, then, you know, uh, combine uh, if the uh, interviewer agrees, then code it. Otherwise, you have to optimize it until mm-hmm. the interviewers agree. And okay. uh, after that, uh, you'll start coding. Okay. And so, uh, before moving forward, like, what about the first step, the coding, uh, the round, uh, the, the, the screening round, I would say, uh, about what, what about that experience? Like, how many questions were there? uh what, what kind of code editor was present online and what platform which on which the amazon test happened uh it is their own platform and you know it was a kind of a code editor of experience only there was mm-hmm. no uh, autocomplete but yeah mm-hmm. indentation and everything was handled by the editor only so okay. you just need to you know remember what exactly the functions and all everything is uh, in whichever language you are coding uh, apart from that uh, they judge you uh, you know some of minor mistakes are uh, you know uh, left off apart from that they judge you on what exactly your approach is uh, how optimize your approach is and what is your coding style like uh, are you coding like and you know uh, pro- giving proper names to the variables and you know following the uh, good coding practices so that's mm-hmm. how they judge you okay so what i'm getting is ki aapka jo uh, questions tha unke solution jitna aap fast likhte usse zyada matter kar raha tha ki aapne kis tarah se uske indentation perfect likha hai kis tarah se explain kar raha hai function ko how good quality function you have written because definitely if you are applying for MNC, they need a good quality code. They are working on uh, exactly. the perf- perfect documentation hona chahiye, perfect uh, way mein hona chahiye so that the other person can pick up from there uh, in the long term. right? And what about this uh, process, if I have to say, like how many questions were there? Uh, what is their difficulty in that sense? And uh, how, many, uh, how much time it took from that uh, screening round to that first interview? So uh, it took around, you know, uh, two weeks for me to get the mm-hmm. result of, you know, the screening round. And e- even after the one week, I was uh, given the mail that I have to get my screening round. But okay. my interviews uh, was scheduled after an, a week or so. So mm-hmm. around two weeks time was there between my screening round and my first interview. Okay. And how, how much time it took from the, your first interview to the last hiring manager interview round? As I told you, you know, the pandemic was there. So my first, after my first two interviews, the, my interview process was on hold. And yeah, mm-hmm. even I was not sure what is happening. Like, because, you know, they were not communicating properly. Uh, like uh, what exactly the stages, even if I'm rejected or not, or I'm selected or not, you know, because they mm-hmm. were not, they haven't communicated anything yet. yet. Mm-hmm. After, you know, around a month or so, I got a mail that, you know, my first two rounds are clear. And okay. uh, due to the pandemic situation, my uh, next round will be, you know, uh, scheduled after a month or so. Okay. So uh, for the viewers, I would say that if you don't get your status, nahi mil rahe, then don't lose hope. It can still be in the right process. You can still get hired. So be patient. Be uh, be regular in taking the right follow-ups with the HR team, the recruitment team. Exactly. And you have a patience ka bahut, bahut, uh, ho ga us time pe. Right. And moving forward. So... How, how much it take like from the hiring manager round, uh, you said it was partially uh, coding based or uh, DSA based and then like partially it was more discussion. Like how was that discussion around? It was like your previous company experience or projects or it was like a normal discussion, uh, any other details you can spare. Yeah, so in my hiring round, there was a one medium level question of DSA. And, you know, uh, the interview was in a hurry. So, you know, uh, we just discussed and coded that approach. And after that, uh, he just jumped into a, you know, a system design type of question. Where mm-hmm. Basically, low-level designing, where I have to design uh, something low, of low level. Uh, I won't uh, be able to, you know, tell you the question exactly. Mm-hmm. Uh, but after that, yeah, uh, we had a discussion about, you know, uh, there are, uh, in Amazon, there are 14 principles, leadership principles, uh, you know, and uh, on that, on basis of that principles, uh, you will be asked uh, questions uh, in each of your interview round. Like, uh, as I told you, you know, the 15 minute time is reserved for that round. And mm-hmm. they uh, see, uh, they are uh, in Amazon, we are really obsessed with these 14 principles. And, uh, you know, uh, we try to amend it in our day to day lives. Uh, 
the okay. 14 leadership principles so if you are you know targeting a company like amazon so you must know how uh, what exactly uh, the company is you know uh, targeting and what exactly is the approach the how the, exactly the things work in the company and what is you know the idea of the company and all mhm okay and uh, like uh, so after you firing hire, final hiring manager round how long uh, what was the experience like for the final offer letter how long did it take, take it did it take for the offer letter to uh, get and uh, like how soon you can join uh, with amazon like what was your joining experience at that time my uh, after my final round i was you know uh, waiting for the result and i uh, have various follow ups but yeah mm-hmm. i got my result after two weeks that's a pretty long time after uh, you know the final Correct. round but yeah after that uh, within a, uh, after getting the you know uh, that i after getting the offer basically that i have been accepted mm-hmm. uh, it took around a week for the offer letter to be generated and yeah okay. uh, uh, when i uh, got the offer letter i was already on my uh, you know notice period so mm-hmm. i was able to join within a month okay ओके सो इफ हैव टू से यहां पे आपके जब जॉइनिंग हो गया अमेजॉन का हाउ वाज दैट एक्सपीरियंस व्हाट आर द बेस्ट थिंग्स दैट यू कैन से कि पूरे इंटरव्यू एक्सपीरियंस में व्हाट वाज द मेन डिफरेंस बिटवीन एमएनसी इंटरव्यू एक्सपीरियंस और अ स्टार्टअप इंटरव्यू एक्सपीरियंस एंड व्हाट आर द की लर्निंग्स फ्रॉम देयर सो द मेजर डिफरेंस दैट आई फेल्ट वाज लाइक इन द एमएनसीज यू आर मोर ऑफ अ नर्वस नर्वस एनवायरनमेंट वाज देयर uh mm-hmm. but in the zomato round it was really pretty chill and you know as i told you he made me really comfortable and you know by uh, we were talking in, uh, about what exactly is going in on our lives about 15 to 20 minutes was like the talk only and mm-hmm. after that our interview started so yeah that was a pretty chill interview and that's why uh, you know uh, i feel like it is the best interview i have ever given Uh, okay. after that in the amazon uh, most of the rounds were you know time based as they are strictly on time so they only have 5 minutes for the uh, intro after that uh, you know they are very uh, time bound so each round have uh, pretty uh, time bound only so uh, at uh, you know end of the uh, round they pretty much left like uh, they don't you know extend the time or something like that mm-hmm. so Uh, they really you know care about what exactly the duration of uh, the interview and they end the interview at uh, exactly uh, an hour mm-hmm. what exactly the uh, interview duration is so okay. yeah okay so I from what like i learn so for, from what i learn that the viewers can uh, observe that for for a zomato like startup uh, the main functionality is that they are very uh, comfortable with extending the duration as well as they are more focused on the developmental learnings of the candidate and how uh, when well exactly. they can explain their pre- previous projects and learnings uh, respective to the profit jo- job role but uh, as i gather for the mnc part you were more they were more focused on completing the uh, the number of questions and all the logical reasoning in the designated time as soon as possible and they were yeah. more focused on their problem solving skills rather than developmental skills as well as uh, the company values or the uh, the logical reasoning behind all, all, all the questions right yeah exactly correct mm-hmm. okay uh, so with that uh, i get uh, like i i am i'm sure the viewers get a lot of information about the interview experiences and the difference between the startup and uh, uh, mnc and i hope they all get to uh, learn all these things and they prepare in their uh, specific manner that if you are going for a startup uh, interview experience prepare in that manner and if you are going for an interview experience at an mnc like amazon google you have to prepare like that uh, i am uh, thanking uh, tanmay for sparing some time for this video and uh thank you so much tanmay for for this video and i hope uh, you get a lot of support. yeah it was a really great uh, you know talking to you discussing all about it and i hope it helps uh, everyone okay watching thank this you. video yeah thank you so much thanks everyone bye bye with this we come to the end of this video uh with tanmay arya i hope you got a lot of information about zomato and amazon interview experiences i hope you will able to find out the, those differences and how to prepare for these companies and if this help please like the video and share this with your friends who are applying for the matter interview and amazon interviews right i hope this will be able to help you a lot in your preparation and uh, i hope you get the uh, the job opportunity at these companies 
uh, with this i really thank tanmay arya for uh, providing the right uh, time for this video from his busy schedule and i will be bringing more such amazing guests from different different uh, companies so that they can share their experiences with you guys um uh, with this i take the leave from this video bye bye